this company, this company, this company, all these companies are currently hiring for the temporary work or charity work visa in the UK. In this video, we're going to look at the eligibility requirement and how you can apply. If you're new to my channel, be sure to smash the subscribe button and let's jump in to this video. The temporary work or charity worker visa permits you to move to the UK if you want to do unpaid voluntary work for charity and you must fulfill these eligibility requirements. Now, the first one is you need to have a certificate of sponsorship reference number from your UK sponsor. In a moment, we are going to look at these companies that are currently sponsoring Visa. So stay tuned. Now, after you have fulfilled that condition, you need to have enough money to support yourself in the UK. You usually need at least £1,270 available unless you are exempt. We're going to look at this and you should be 18 years and over when you apply. If you fulfill all these conditions, the only thing you need to do is you need to apply for this visa. Now, let's look at the companies that are currently hiring. Newton D is one of those companies currently hiring voluntary short-term co-workers. Let's look at it in details. We accept applications for a short-term voluntary co-worker positions throughout the year. Our short-term co-workers come from all over the world. From those outside the UK, we can sponsor a tier 5 voluntary visa. So you can actually be sponsored by them. This is wonderful. And the application process is so simple because all you need to do is you can download the application form by clicking the link below. So this is the link to the application form. But before we check out the application form, they also mentioned that we are accepting applications for co-workers willing to stay at least three months. But we will give preference to applicants who can stay six months or a year. So the longer you stay, the better it is. So I suggest you take one year so that you have a high chance to be accepted by them for sponsorship. Let's take a look at um, one of their points they mentioned on sponsorship. So if you're going to be needing a, a visa from them, they mention here that we will help you guide you through the visa application process. We will write you a sponsorship certificate and you will need to make the appointment and pay the fees yourself. Now. This is the price of the application fees. It's going to cost you £259. That's the price for application fees. Remember, you're also going to pay an additional cost of £624 per year. That is for your health insurance. It's very important. But of course, if you're staying lesser, I don't know, but you have to confirm if you still have to pay the same amount. Here we are at the application form. To, up, to open the application form, we can simply click on this and it takes us to the form. It's a seven page document, which you should fill with, with prudence. Now you have to attach a photo of yourself. You key in your general information. You have to fill in these details. These are all basic details that you need to key in. And then you move on to talk about how long you wish to stay. I would like us to move on to uh, point number seven. That is where you talk about the language. All these are basic requirements, but the language skills is very important since you'll be working with mostly people who speak English. Now you have to say how well you speak English. Make sure you feel this part and pay attention when you're filling this form. Once you're done, you can submit this document. Now you see, it's a very simple process. So take your time and go over it and apply take your chance. This might just be the chance. next company on our list is Lee Abbey London. This company also sponsor voluntary or charity worker visa. Now let's move on to see they have a key requirement that they need. Of course, if you are not a Christian, unfortunately, this is not for you. Let's take a try. If you believe in Jesus as Lord, if you take yes, of course, you can proceed to select the rest of your requirement. But if you take no, Unfortunately, you see that they, don't, they do not accept your application. So it is meant for religious people. So keep it that in mind. Then if you meet those criteria, of course, you can go further to apply. This other company is also hiring at the moment. I will leave the links in the description. The process is the same. All you need to do is you will need to put in your name, put in your email address, 
then you submit a comment you have to specify if you're applying for living support or you want to join the long-term voluntary co-worker then you can submit your application they're going to get back to you with the necessary feedback and all the details that you need to continue with your application the temporal or the charity worker visa is a great way to move to the uk you don't need any language requirement you don't need to spend a lot of money so if you're interested in this visa i'm going to leave the links in the description so that you can check for yourself and apply remember pay due diligence when you're submitting the application because it's very competitive since there are many people applying for this visa if you have any question be sure to drop it in the comment section and please like comment and subscribe to my channel so you wouldn't miss any details like this